Uh, good morning everybody. My name is Charles de Tue, as you most probably know. And I'm sitting here uh, on the veranda of our home in uh, Silent Valley, nestled in the Waterbird Mountains. And uh, Bilamin and I have been talking about our upcoming uh, auction, which is going to take place on the 9th of May in, uh, in 2020. Doesn't seem possible that 2019 is just about finished, but uh, we are we are very excited because um, five years ago when we bought Silent Valley, we we had a dream and we called it our our Silent Valley dream. That dream was to become one of the top uh, breeding uh, game breeding farms in Southern Africa, and. Uh, you know, others may disagree, but I want to tell you that uh, that dream of ours has come true. Um, over the years, we have obtained the very best genetics that we could find. And in all of our breeding programs, we have the top um, genetics in Southern Africa. What really excites us, however, is something that very few people know about. Um, the Waterberg Silent Valley is actually the home of the giant, uh, giant kudus of Southern Africa. And uh, you may be interested in knowing that we have no less than 10 breeding programs here at Silent Valley. And that each of our breeding bulls are in excess of 60 inches. And now I'm not even talking about Nkosi who now measures 68 inches. He's going to be another 75, maybe even an 80 inch bull one day. And then we have uh, Nkulu Nkulu uh, and he is measuring way over 66 inches. What's so amazing about the 10 breeding bulls that we have is that genetically they are not related. So uh, you can imagine the excitement that we have that uh, each of these bulls are walking with at least 30 cows. Uh, you've got to understand that's over 300 uh, kudu uh, breeding herds or breeding animals that we have. And the mountains are full of their offspring. Wherever we go, we see these amazing young bulls that are now coming through. Young bulls that will eventually be the 75 inches and the, maybe even the 80 inches of the future. The reality is that uh, the kudu, you know, is the first animal that is hunted and it's all the big bulls that are taken out, the good genetics are taken out. Um, what we have here is we, we have a program where we're going to reintroduce those giants of the past. And I think that's going to be the highlight at uh, the auction on, on the 9th of uh, May uh, 2020 because we are going to start in our program of making these genetics available to our fellow uh, game breeders. So that's really going to be a very, very exciting part of the, uh, of the auction. Uh, not to mention all the other top genetics that uh, we'll be putting on including uh, you know, genetics of our sable bulls that are in the region of 52 inches and our uh, nyala bulls that are 32 inches um, and our beautiful uh, uh, king wildebeest that uh, uh, you're just going to marvel at. So uh, being our first auction we are very excited but obviously we are also you know, we have a bit of trepidation because we are entering into an industry where our predecessors have been uh, in the industry for 40 years and more. And uh, so obviously, you know, we have a huge respect for uh, these men and women and we, we have so much to learn from them here. To help us with our auction, Philomene and I decided that we would approach eight of the top breeders um, to, to join us 
as our guest sellers. And um, I need to apologize up front. If you're not one of those eight, um, it's the only reason why you're not is that there were only eight that, uh, that we could uh, accommodate. But I do want to share with you who they are um, and how excited they were when we approached them about being part of this uh, auspicious occasion. So when I spoke to Teboko from, from Babirwa uh, Wildlife, uh, to say the least, he was, he was highly uh, excited because he has some really good animals that he wants to put onto the auction. Uh, when I spoke to Soli from uh, Bakia Wild, Soli was beside himself. And as you all know, Soli is so well known for his Livingston e uh, uh, Elan, um, and he's going to be putting on some really special animals uh, that, uh, that is going to help the industry to, uh, uh, in their breeding activities. When I spoke to Angus from uh, uh, Kwandwe Wildlife. Uh, Angus said this is exactly what he needed to, uh, to have this platform where he could showcase his animals. When I spoke to Louis, he was very excited because I understand Louis has some, some really exciting waterbuck uh, genetics. He has some really fantastic um, springbucks from the Kalahari and uh, Louis is going to be one of our guest, um, our guest sellers. Peter Tue, <coughs> also, when I approached Pitt, he was uh, totally committed and excited about uh, this opportunity for him. Peter Prinsloo approached me and asked me whether he couldn't bring some of his original uh, Silent Valley sable animals, the original uh, sables that came from, from Zambia, uh, the very same uh, Silent Valley sables that the, that the legendary pit um, uh, came from. So he's going to bring, uh, he's going to be showcasing some of those uh, Silent Valley uh, animals as well. Vian from Winterzoek, he was besides himself when I spoke to him. Um, so Vian is going to bring along one of his 51-inch uh, buffalo bulls. Now, that doesn't happen any, every day. Uh, great excitement. It's going to be so much interest. Everybody wants a buffalo bull that's over 50 inches. Even I want one. So, uh, uh, Vian, your presence is going to really be appreciated. Warwick from Woody Cape, uh, Wood, Wood Cape Wildlife, Woody Cape Wildlife, um, is also very excited to be part of, uh, of this auspicious uh, occasion. And then from Namibia, uh, from Klaverberg Stud Game Breeders, we are going to be bringing some uh, uh, Kalahari Gemsbok, 40 inches plus. We're going to be bringing some genetics of the, the, the infamous uh, uh, Blixum, the breeding bull, uh, way over uh, 46 inches. Two of his sons will be on auction uh, at uh, the Irene Lodge. We're also going to bring some, uh, some really great uh, um, Kalahari Springbuck genetics. And, Red, for, to everybody's surprise, we have got some huge Willabeast um, bulls and uh, cows that we are going to be uh, showcasing at the, at the auction. So, um, this is going to be a very special occasion. But I think that the greatest thing about this auction is actually going to be the kudus. Because uh, never before in the history of this industry have we had such a diverse uh, gen a gene pool of the very best kudus that you could possibly get. Genes of uh, the original giants of the kudu world. So uh, don't miss this one. Uh, it's going to be 
a really exciting occasion. So we look forward to, to having you there and entertaining you and to getting to know you better and we look forward to doing something special together as an industry as we continue to uh, improve the genetic uh, makeup of the wildlife in South Africa. We'll see you there. Thank you very much.